It's time now for the award-winning Sports Zone with Drew Goldfarb. Good evening, everyone. I'm Drew Goldfarb. This is the 13 Sports Zone live on location from Laidley Field. College football season is finally upon us, at least at the Division II level. Both of our local schools, we've got West Virginia State here in the white. We've got the University of Charleston in the maroon and gold. They are about to get underway, about 45 minutes or so from now for kickoff of this game to open up the 2018 season. Now, last year, these two rivals opened up the year against one another as well, with last year's game being played in the Institute. That was the beginning of the John Pennington era for the Yellow Jackets as WVSU beat UC 51-28 in a game that was just rain-soaked in 2017. The Jackets went on to post a winning record for the first time since joining the Mountain East that year. Charleston, meanwhile, coming off of a four and six season, four of those six losses though last year, coming by just a single score. And the Golden Eagles are hoping to get a few more bounces going their way in 2018. Mountain East Conference announced the addition of two new member programs today. Dave's and Elkins College accepted an offer to become a full member of the MEC, while UNC Pembroke will become an associate member joining for football and four other sports. Centers will join the East Division next year. The Braves teams will begin conference play over the course of the next two years. Marshall opens its season just two days from now against Miami of Ohio. After picking up a bowl win to close out last year, the Herd returned many starters for 2018. When it comes to the running back position, that actually means a pair of players. Doc Holliday lists as co-starters for week one, and that's exactly how running backs Keon Davis and Tyler King view the situation as well. I know if 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 I go down, well, if he go down, he know he got me. If I go down, I know you know what I'm saying vice versa. So even when if he break out for a big run, he need a playoff. He know I'm gonna come in and I'm gonna get my job done. That's what he counting on me to do. That's what I'm counting on him to do. So but that's basically it. The West Virginia Power are hoping to get into the postseason. They have a very slight percentage points edge on the Kannapolis Intimidators. We'll see how that game goes at 7.05. It is their regular season home finale. Back here at Laidley Field, you see West Virginia State college football season kicking off at 7.05 or so. More on this game coming up tonight at 11. Right now, let's check in on the Mountaineers with tonight's West Virginia Illustrated Report.